everyone and welcome to the three o'clock tour of the Field Museum's newly expanded Tang Dynasty exhibit. Made possible by a generous grant Donald Trump preemptively made before saying whatever racist thing he was going to say <laughs> about the Chinese people this week. Now, before we enter the Tang Dynasty exhibit, are there any questions? Yeah, uh, when are we gonna get to taste the Tang? Excuse me? <laughs> are we gonna get to taste the Tang on the tour or are we gonna have to wait to buy some at the gift shop on our way out? I think there might be some confusion. Because when I went on the Coca-Cola tour, they let you taste the Coca-Cola free of charge. That, they do that. Yeah, that's what they do. Uh, to, be, <laughs> to be clear, this is a tour of the Field Museum's collection of Chinese artifacts from the Tang period. This is not a tour of the Tang powder drink facility. So? So no, you won't be able to taste any Tang on the tour. So I'll just have to buy some at the gift shop then? I don't think we sell any Tang at the gift shop. Well, that just seems like a missed opportunity. Okay. Are there any other questions? Yeah, right here, Toots. Yes, you. <laughs> yeah, how much Tang you got in there? Uh, the Tang Dynasty exhibit features over 200 pieces. Ooh, that's a lot. It is. And can we touch the girls, or can they only touch us? I'm sorry? The 200 naked Chinese ladies ready to show us the Tangs. Can we touch them or not, lady? That is the most offensive thing I have ever heard in a museum. Ah. I've heard worse. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm checking in. What? I'm checking in on Foursquare. This is the Illinois Holocaust Museum. And I'm the mayor. <laughs> <laughs> Look, this way I'll never forget. <laughs> you thought me. You told us that there were 200 Chinese pieces of ass in there. It, it did kind of sound like yeah, that. Yeah, totally No. <laughs> I said that there were 200 pieces, 200 artifacts from the Tang period. This tour is an exploration of the long-lasting cultural influence of the Chinese people from this time period. It is not an adult entertainment show featuring 200 naked women of Chinese ancestry. It is still not a tour of the Tang powder drink manufacturing facility. Any other questions? Yes. How extensive is your coverage of Emperor Gaozu? In particular, does the exhibit contain artifacts linked to his rebellion against Yang of Sweet prior to becoming emperor himself? Oh, yes. Yes, we do. While items from this period are scarce, we have some remarkable documents as recorded by Gaozu's second son, Li Ximin, who you might know better as Emperor, emperor Tai Sun. <gasps> <laughs> Thank you. Well, all right, let's get started on the tour. Yeah, on second thought, we're gonna swing by a Mariano's, pick up some Tang, and go drink it at a Chinese strip club. <laughs> According to Google Maps, the strip club is called Mongolian Beef Curtains. Yeah. Okay, well, you two enjoy yourselves. No accounting for taste. Hey, uh, you, you wanna come with us? To drink Tang and watch Chinese strippers? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that sounds like way more fun. <laughs> Tang! Tang! Hey! I'll put my face in it! <laughs> Me too! Uh, 